I guess for brokers and the rest of us that participate directly in that final settlements and lodgement process, um, the process will be much more visible, much more transparent. Um, if you think about the process today, what you have is effectively four parties going on an expedition out to the settlements room at a predetermined destination. Their eyes meet across the room and they gather around a settlements table exchanging those physical documents and, and throwing over a bunch of bank checks to complete that settlement. Not much is heard from the agents once until they come back to the office, come back to home base, log the fruits of their labour and uh, a notification is sent round to people like brokers, like lenders and, and service providers. Um, in an e-conveyancing environment that all changes. You know, that settlement table is now a virtual workspace. The participants to that settlements transaction attend in a virtual world online. Um, no one leaves their office and uh, documents are exchanged electronically. Funds are dispersed, importantly, electronically. And where there is a flaw in that transaction, you're not going back and starting that whole process again. Everyone around that virtual table is aware of that, that glitch and the rectification is efficient and the feedback immediate. I think that is the key to visibility and transparency that will make for brokers a happier customer at the end of the day and, um, and, and what's good for the end consumer is good for the broker. You know, we can all imagine the large technology build that's been involved in this initiative, but I think, you know, well beyond that um, will be the challenge of change management and, uh, and take up. So we've had this manual labour intensive process for an awfully long time for that settlements piece of the process. Um, and old habits are hard to change. So, so take up will be a key issue for, for PEXA. Um, they're certainly focused on that and I think have made good traction in that area. Um, ultimately their pricing too will, be, will have to be conducive to that take up challenge. I would say from an FMS perspective where we do operate as part of the First American family, we operate across about 60 countries, 1200 offices globally and um, we would see Australia as being quite far behind in terms of the automation of that settlements part of the process right now. But I think with this initiative, um, when you compare it to some of the e-conveyancing jurisdictions that have been well established for some years, the, the difference will be that um, the degree of electronic settlement and digitisation will be far advanced when the PEXA platform is live and, and running at a critical mass. Um, in countries such as New Zealand and Canada, they do have the e-conveyancing capability there and, and live, uh, but what you'll find in some of those jurisdictions is that the electronic documents are exchanged, but the, the disbursement of funds is still a manual one. Now Australia will surpass that once, once the platform is at its full capability.